Hello guys, once again it's Matt and today we have another video, thank you all the members, all the Patreons, make sure to subscribe and let's get into it guys. So, apparently, I mean, I'm not gonna say he denied it, but in a forum, or uh, a Discord, sorry, uh, is mean basically, um, kinda deny it that Fox Trees are coming next patch. He didn't like actually fully deny it, so we still have hope, I think. Uh, but he basically said there is no time frame on the Fox 3 missiles, which means it's kind of weird. We don't, like I said, this could be just a misinterpretation or one of the community manager managers not having the full information of what the patch will be like. There is no confirmation or denial that these missiles are coming. Okay, so please don't consider that uh, when like commenting or just considering everything it's just kind of fun to you know discuss a little bit what it would be like because if fox trees are not added guys um i don't think the gripen would be added as well which brings a big problem if this is the case um there is another patch that sweden will be kind of left behind but as i said it's just assumptions right now we don't know exactly um we're basically just assuming because there's no information on the patch yet until it's the, the it's like dev block season starts right which should which by the way should be um you know starting next week probably um or maybe the week afterwards probably more likely to be honest but you know, we're close to it, so all these answers will be, um, or all these questions will be answered uh, very, very shortly, um, after the, like, one or two weeks. Um, but still, it is kind of funny to wonder a little bit how it would be like, um, because we know it's a big patch. Uh, we know we probably won't see any type of sub-tree or big tree coming up. Probably, because it was kind of denied, right? Um, and then we have this information that they don't have a time frame on the Fox 3 missiles, which means that they are probably not... Like, they're probably still working on it. Like, what are we getting? <laughs> it's kind of funny to even wonder about, isn't it? Because... Um, I mean, in my personal channel and, and my personal opinion... I think even though it wasn't confirmed and they never like said anything that in the December patch we would have these and that's basically what he said on the post, right? Um, I think 99% of the people that actually pay attention to the... basically to, to what is happening to the game and uh, is playing especially top tier Jets, right? Which is, I think it's a large amount of player uh, of the player base, I, I would think at least. Um, are basically waiting for these missiles, are expecting these missiles. So, um, I don't know, it, it, it is kind of weird. Uh, one of the options, of course, um, remember, they don't have to add anything. Uh, so, for example, if it's not added, uh, they can still add some aircraft that would be very, very fun to fly and still not have the Fox 3 missiles. Of course, the F-15, F-18, the SU-27, um, more advanced versions of aircraft that we already have, like um, maybe a new aircraft like the J-10, I don't know, there are many options of aircraft that are still going to be interesting even without the Fox 3, so it, it doesn't mean the end of the world. But if this is the case, if this is an actual denial, which I personally don't think it is, as I said, but um, if it is kind of a nuance to a to a denial, um, they have still one option with the Gripen, right? Uh, that would be adding its kind of prototypes that they had uh, testing with the RB seventy one. I I don't know ex actually if they actually fired um, a, with a Gripen a RB seventy one or the Sparrow. But there are some manual pages that confirm that they were planning to like have this missile 
um, as kind of a backup. Of course, with the end of the Cold War and with everything that happened in the 90s and the introdu introduction of the Gripen, uh, they introduced it very quickly afterwards, um, after the, the, the overall admission of the m 20 in service, the RB99, which is an m 20 b to the service. But in that short period of the time that m 20 wasn't really there maybe or something like that, in theory, maybe the first grip it could use the RB71, which means that um, maybe we can see a Gripen with Sparrows, which would be really sad, uh, and it would mean that they are waiting to implement the Fox 3s when um, more countries can actually use them, and this time frame would be kind of pushed towards next year. So that would be my best guess of what is going to happen. I still believe firmly that something is going to be added for the UK as an aircraft, uh, top tier aircraft, and for the Swedish as well. Um, not, I, I firmly believe, I don't have any side information, but I, I just really hope so, basically, uh, that that happens, right? Because it's the two nations that are in the most dire need of new aircraft, right, uh, in top tier. So hopefully they add something, even if it's just using a sparrow or something like that, right? So, I don't know, it just feels weird. As I said, again, it's not a denial that the Fox 3s are coming, but it is a weird kind of answer, isn't it? Like, there's no time frame? It means that they're really, like, they're working on it, but it doesn't mean that they're close to adding them. So maybe we will have just a, a normal all-arounder patch that adds new aircraft for everybody or for a lot of countries uh, being a kind of a big patch that is kind of confirmed to be. Um, but it doesn't mean that it's going to be like actual, actually like um, game changer, uh, changing, right? So something along those lines. At least this is my idea on it. It kind of got me confused because, again, uh, some people are just completely going for it that this is a denial for the Fox 3s. It really is not. It's just kind of like leads you to think that it is. So, kind of sad if it's the case, but oh well, we don't have the control, uh, any control over these. So, yeah, of course, we need just to, to hope for the best. And be excited because every single December patch is normally a very big one and a very fun one. Um, I think it's a perfect position to... Uh, they're in the perfect position to just help nations that are really, uh, you know, lacking a little bit right now. The majority of the nations already have plenty of good aircraft, so that would be the perfect kind of patch for me. Adding stuff for, for minor nations that need... or quote-unquote minor nations but anyway let me know in the comments what you think if it's if you think it's uh, an actual denial of the fox trees or not uh, or if i'm just going crazy a little bit uh, but uh, anyway let me know in the comments and i see you guys on the next one okay bye guys